Parents are rallying to support plaques at their kids' school. The signs have come under fire for their religious references. Fox Force Phil Alvarado reports two religious rights groups may be headed for a showdown over whether the plaques stay or go. Parents and students gathered to pray at Long Branch Elementary, proclaiming their faith while others try to tear down their plaques. I do feel it's appropriate. Lauren Johnson believes it's okay to keep plaques with religious references dedicating Long Branch and Mount Peak elementaries. They've been up since 1997. They say in part the schools were dedicated to the education of God's children and to their faithful teachers in the name of the Holy Christian Church. The plaque at Mount Peak had been covered over with duct tape. The one at Long Branch was not. The school district says someone uncovered the Mount Peak plaque and there is no plan to cover it again. The fight is not over the plaques anymore. We're not here to, to protest, you know, keep the plaque here. Whether the plaque stays or goes, you know, we're a faith-based community and, and it'll be that way and, and God will continue to be in our schools regardless. The Freedom From Religion Foundation has threatened to sue the Midlothian School District over the plaques. They can't endorse or promote religion in general or a particular religion over other religions. And this plaque uh, does both. The Liberty Institute in Plano defends the plaques. Hiram Sasser says the Constitution also forbids government hostility against religion. This type of religious censorship, just because, of, uh, you know, just because it happens to have some religious references, is really hostility to religion, and that kind of hostility should not be tolerated. Sasser believes the school district should not back down before there's a lawsuit. They probably are not going to bring a lawsuit, and until they do, there's no reason to do anything with a plaque. The Freedom From Religion Foundation says it stepped in after someone in the community complained. The Liberty Institute says unless that person comes in contact with the plaques, they have no right to sue. Phil Alvarado, Fox 4 News.